Hi everyone, I'm so excited to come to you today and uh, share with you all of the amazingly beautiful Christmas cards and holiday cards that I received this holiday season. So my family and I took a vacation. Uh, we decided to take the boys out of town for Christmas and we drove to Florida, quite a long trip. And when we got there, by that night or early that morning, my youngest started throwing up, spiked a high fever and had COVID, tested positive. So like the story goes, within a few hours or days, we all test positive um, for this awful virus. So, but good news is, is we all recovered. We're doing perfectly, you know, we're doing perfectly fine. And, you know, praise God, nobody had to go to the doctor or the hospital. Um, but during that time of being kind of, you know, down and sad and spending, all of us spending Christmas, out of town in a condo, um, sick, I got to open up your Christmas and holiday cards. And I have never felt so much love and been so inspired to get home and start crafting. Oh my gosh, I can't thank you enough. I really, from the bottom of my heart, I'm so grateful. And um, I think this is the most cards I have ever received. And I want to show them to you today. They are all gorgeous and just so many beautiful creations. So I'm just going to go ahead and share them with you. I'm going to lay them out a few at a time and I'm going to share them with you. And I think you're going to be inspired too. You guys are so talented and I am so grateful to be on this crafting and stamping journey with you. And please know when I received your card, I just felt so much love. That is what your handmade cards do for others. So um, I got to experience that joy um, while I was sick nonetheless. So I'm just so grateful and um, I appreciate you sending these cards to me. And so I'm going to show you um, just all of this amazing card making uh, stuff we got here. So let me show you these cards. So let's check out this first one. So this first one is so cute. Gnomes. That's right. So here's another one. And then this one's actually Thanksgiving from Luann, but I thought it was so cute. I wanted to share it with you. This one was from Miss Patty. This one was from Leslie. And that one is also, that one's from Kathy. And um, so here, Melissa, look at that cute little gingerbread. I think that was from the paper pumpkin, right? And then Miss Dolores, she had fun time with those cute little donkeys. So that is a really just so much fun, so many beautiful cards. So let me show you a few more. So this one I thought was fun. This one's from D. Tierra. And you know, that one has the fun little calendar here in the front. So I thought that was cool. And this is from Webra. This was her uh, Thanksgiving card that she sent me. That one is from Lolita. She always has such fun cards to send me. Check out this one. This one's from Leslie and it's got that three type of, um, you know, just kind of a fun type fold card. And um, here, let's just look at some of these other ones. Look at that beautiful one from Donna. And there's one from Miss Jane. So just some super fun. I love the glitter. I love the sparkles and the accents. Oh my goodness. Y'all have outdone yourselves for sure. All right. So let's look at this next set. And so here's another beautiful card. And that one's from Barbara and Miss Betty. Check out. Whoops. I flipped that one over. Look at that fun card. So this one is kind of another fun type fold. How cool is that, Betty? You are so clever. Clever, clever, clever. And so this one's from Carmel. Look how pretty and sparkly that one is. Oh my goodness. And Miss Jane. And so the cool thing, Miss Jane put in a little tea bag in that one. So cute, super cute. And then this one here is from Bonnie. And that one is kind of another really fun, clever fold. Bonnie, that is so cute. I love that, that fold and how you did that. Poinsett is beautiful too. Awesome. Oh, I love that peaceful paper. I'm so sad that that is, uh, that is discontinued or, or sold out, I should say. All right. So check out this beautiful card. And this one is from Kathy. Look how pretty that is. Such a fun type fold. Absolutely gorgeous. 
And this one here is from Cecilia. I love this angel. Oh my goodness, I'm so sad that she did not carry over. This one's from Marianne. And um, this one's from Kat. And let's see what else we have here. We have a beautiful card from Tahira. Oh my goodness, love it. Love that stamp set. That's those trees. I can't remember the name of it. Pattern something maybe. Um, and that one's from Betty. So beautiful. Such beautiful cards. Love them. I love the sparkles and like, gosh, look at how the, the designer papers here, just how you can layer them so differently just to really create kind of that fun artistic look. All right, so check out this one. This is cute. We've got some fun donkeys. I mean, who knew that the donkeys could be so stinking cute, Stephanie? Love it. You did so good with that. Um, so cute. And this one, another super cute card by Susan and how she um, used the dies and then you can kind of see the, I think maybe that's crystal effects in there. Super cute. And that one's from Sally. Um, and this one is from Jane. And we also have one here from Kira. Oh gosh, that's that gingerbread set. Oh, I love that set. And I'm so sad to see that one go. And that one's from my friend Lolita. That's right, so beautiful cards. Look at the sparkle. Gosh, that paper is gorgeous. And what a cute little bow. I need to take bow tie-in lessons. That is so cute, so cute. All right, so let me show you a few more that I received. So this one is from Barb. Oh gosh, that's beautiful. And that is the die, and I believe that was cut out of that, um, oh, what is, excuse me, I got the hiccups all of a sudden, that kind of snow paper. Um, it's kind of velvety, it was really nice. Penny, and look at that one, how she did those pine cones. Oh my goodness gracious, that's gorgeous. And then this one is so cute. This one is from Luann. Sadly, forgot, Frosty forgot his hot cocoa turned out to be his last. That is just so stinking cute, isn't it? And then this one was from Arlene. And then we have one from Carolyn, another really cute, cute card. I like that twine on there. And then we have one from Dorothy. So again, using that peaceful place, um, beautiful designer paper, and she added her deer. Such a beautiful job. It's hard to, gosh, it's just like so much inspiration here, right? So I will definitely be enjoying those. I like to see your cards and see what you're creating because it helps me come up with ideas for the retreats and for some different things that I'm doing and for videos. This one's from Vernita and it is beautiful. I look at the paper behind here. I'm trying to think, what is that? That is beautifully done, that glitter behind there. All right, so then this one is from Amy. And this was that beautiful paper pumpkin that we just had. It was stunning. And Miss Susie, look at that. Isn't those layers lovely? I like how those layers and that metallic paper behind there. And then here's another fun one. This one is from Kim. Wow, Kim, that is awesome. And that's like a five by seven one. So that one, that one is neat too. And so this one is from Maxine. And um, I just, I thought that was really cute how she did that. Cute little, little bells, right? And then this one is from Jennifer and she embossed that background and just, you know, layered it up really beautifully done. So another set of beautiful cards. Thank you so much for sending them to me and for thinking of me, I'm so grateful. And here is another set of beautiful cards. So check out this cute little puppy. I love it. So this one is from my friend Maria Robinson, and she's actually one of my team members. And here's from Darlene. Oh my gosh, so cute. And check out this card from Pam. Oh my gosh, Pam, what a beautiful job you did coloring your bird. I love it, love it, love it, love it. This one is from Stampin' Storage. As you know, I use a lot of their products and I am an affiliate for Stampin' Storage. And so they sent me a really nice thank you note for sharing their products. And then I have one here from Dolores. Very pretty, Miss Dolores, love it. 
And um, here is another one and it looks like I put it back in the plastic. So let me take it out of the plastic really quick. And I'm gonna just open it up really quick here. And um, here we go. So this one is just another gorgeous, gorgeous card. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? Love it, love it, love it. So there's another gorgeous set of cards. Oh, I just love them. This was from Carol. It's such a beautiful, that ornament was just so pretty in that paper, gosh. This was from Tanya. Tanya's on my team. And just so pretty, those little stockings. This one was from Miss Sandy. Let me show you this one. Wow, look at those, uh, that, back, that embossed background kind of looks like snow. It's so nice, right? This one's from Kathy, so really nice. And then this one is from Leslie. So this one is, um, it looks like she did one of our techniques from the, or maybe actually that's embossing paste. I don't think it was from the retreat, but it does look like kind of that alcohol ink type look. So nice. This one is from Jill. So just another really nice set of cards and they're all so different. That's what I love is how different they are and how unique they are. That is the beauty of paper crafting. There's so many possibilities. This one is from my friend Priscilla. Another fun card there. And um, this one's from Bonnie. I love that gold background and she looks like she embossed her notes in that. So nice. And then this one's from Miss Linda. And I love how she did that different designer paper back there. Pretty clever. There's one from Darlene. And um, it looks like she, it looks like maybe she cut the designer paper and layered that up or maybe cut that out of some paper. So cute. Really nicely done. That one's from Barbara. And I like how she stamped her whole background. She made her own designer series paper. That is something I enjoy doing. This one's from Miss Sandy. This one's very sparkly, so pretty. I love those whimsical trees, right? So fun. So beautiful set of cards, right? So, so nice. Gosh, I wish I would have had all of these to show you before Christmas so we could have all gotten a million Christmas card ideas. So many fun ideas. Now this one's from my friend Robin. And Robin, yours didn't fare well in the mail. I'm not sure if somebody decided to munch on it or sit on it or what happened, but it is absolutely beautiful and I love it. Um, she used the, um, the fun, uh, the technique that I showed at the Creative 8 Retreat uh, for the Fall 2021 Creative 8 Retreat. This was a fun technique that I shared. Um, absolutely beautiful, I love it. This one's from Trudy and this one, um, pretty cool. She, uh, this is a tag that you can um, take out and use. This one is from Miss Donna. How pretty is that? Love the wreath. Yep, love it. Whoops, sorry about that. This one's from Miss Mary. And um, picture of her family. And so how pretty is that? Ooh, pretty, 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 pretty. I think that may have been, is that a stamp set from last year, I think? Maybe. And um, this one is from Sheila. So pretty. And then this one is from Cheryl. Those polar bears, oh, weren't they just like adorable? And look at that in that, gl that glitter paper. Just really looks like snow and ice. So, so cool. So cool. All right. So I've got about mm, 10 or 15 more. So let's, um, let's have a look. So check out this one. This one is from Linda. And look how she put the different designer papers together. And then it looks like she embossed it as well with snowflakes. Isn't that lovely? Wow, that is really cool. All right, so we were talking about Robin's card and the technique that I shared at the retreat. So this one is also from, um, you know, was shared at the retreat. And check out this beautiful, beautiful card. Oh my gosh, I absolutely think it is absolutely stunning, stunning, stunning. So this one is from Sharon. She's one of my team members. And um, that is just gorgeous, right? And here's another one that was shared with me, um, that was sent to me, and it was also uh, that same sort of type of design. 
This one's from Leslie. Leslie and ladies, thanks so much for thinking of me and, and sending me those beautiful cards and holiday wishes to know that I inspired you to try that is super cool. That one's from Trisha. And this one here is from Jill. That's fun. And then we have one here from Mary Beth. So again, another beautiful set of cards. I loved this melody. I believe that's from that melody um, suite that we had. So, so, so pretty. All right. So I've got a couple more sets. And um, so let's see who we have. Arlene. Oh, so pretty. I love it. I love the joy. And then this one's Jeanette and that uh, peaceful place paper again. So nice. And this one's Juanita. I like how she did the, um, the twine on there. That is so fun. And then we have one from Debbie. And so that's pretty. I like those colors. And then we also have one here from Sharon. Pretty Sharon, I like the layers. I like how you did that. And the snowflake, of course, those were the best. That one's from Deborah. So just pretty use of the designer paper. Gosh, isn't it just amazing when you look at all those and all the different ways that you can, you know, layer stuff and add, you know, add different types of designer papers and so forth. So cool. So that one's from Sharon. And this one is from Miss Melissa. Wow, that is a, um, that is one, I believe, one of her Thanksgiving cards. I did pull a few of those because I thought they were so fun and I really wanted to share them with you. This card is from Debbie, kind of has a fun little front opening there. Super, super cute. It also opens on the inside here as well. So I love that and how you framed that, that cute little die. All right, so let me show you. This one's from Cynthia. Oh gosh, it's so pretty, the Amaryllis of Bloom. That one is one of my favorite sets. So sad that it's gonna retire soon. This is from Elizabeth, so pretty. It looks like she kind of paired maybe the Peaceful Place and, and a couple other of the papers, so nice. And here's one from Angela. So again, another set of beautiful, beautiful cards, right? It's like, where in the world do you start? So much inspiration there. So neat. Okay, so let's see what we have. We've got a few more here. Check this one out. This is fun. This one opens like such. Isn't that cool? Oh my gosh, I think that's so cool. So this one's from Sarah. And then you just kind of tuck it back in there, I believe, to kind of put it back together. Let's see. Okay, well, I'll have to do that off camera, but it's super cute and I love it. So really, really fun. And then let's see what else we have here. There's one from Katie, another amaryllis. Love the amaryllis. And then I have another one here from Miss Lolita. And this one is from Lori. That's pretty cute. She like, she uh, embossed her cardstock and then looks like she sponged it. Really nice. And this one's from Cheryl. Yep, Miss Cheryl. Oh, I love the, um, Man, I love that celebration sparkle stuff in the background there. That was so nice. Um, Karen, this is a fun one from Karen. So again, another nice set of cards. So, um, just so beautiful, so much fun. All right, so it looks like I might have one more set for you. So I've got one more set of cards here. And look at this one, wow. So pretty, and so this one's from Donna, and this is kind of that easel type of card. So let me show you sideways. So it's one of those, what they call an easel card, and then she put a fun calendar on that. That is so clever, Miss Donna, I love it. Thank you for thinking of me and sending me one of those. This one is from Barb, pretty. That, um, I think that some of that came from the kit. Um, so nice. This one's from Kat. Um, super cute. And oh, I've got some gnomes coming from Peggy. Look at that. Oh, those are some cute little gnomes. Oh my goodness. I had no idea how much I love gnomes, but I do. I love gnomes. All right. And then I also have one for, uh, from one of, um, my customers, Walter. He always does these beautiful envelopes and, um, his cards are always so decorated 
beautifully with gems and all kinds of beautiful things. So this one is from Walter. Um, so absolutely gorgeous, so many beautiful cards. Um, and I'm just so excited to, um, you know, to share all of them with you. I have never felt so loved. So thank you for your gift of sending me these beautiful cards. And, um, you know, sometimes I get those emails from y'all that say, you know, your happy mail arrives just when I needed it most. When, you know, maybe I was down that day or I had forgotten about it or what, you know, had a hard day, whatever the scenario is, um, I do receive those emails that touch my heart when you tell me that that package arrives at the perfect time. Well, I have to say that your cards um, were quite an uplifting time for me and I just enjoyed opening every single one of them and looking through them and enjoying them all. So thank you so much for your love, for your support of Brandy's cards. If you're one of my customers, thank you so much for being a loyal customer of Brandy's cards. I look forward to crafting with you well into the new year, right? And, um, and of course, if you know, you aren't one of my customers. I'm so grateful that you are here. Um, and I hope that you enjoy all the inspiration from my talented friends, my crafting friends. And um, so, all right. Well, thank you for joining me. And um, I look forward to crafting with you again soon. Take care. Bye, everybody. Happy New Year.